Good afternoon, students and staff, and welcome to Fitz News. I am Rachel Fitzgerald, and today is May 25th, 2018, and today's show will begin in just a moment. Good afternoon. I'm Courtney Cooper, and let's begin today's show. Hey, seniors, the 2017-18 yearbook is now on sale, and the video yearbook DVD is not part of Package 2 and does need to be purchased separately. The DVD features highlights from Fitzgerald Sports, plays, concerts, swag events, senior celebration, homecoming, prom, and interviews with the class of 2018. Don't miss out on your chance to purchase this special DVD of memories to look back on your senior year. The DVD is only $10 and available from Miss Smith in room E268. Stop by the studio and pick up your copy today. Attention all Amate Cultural Club members. Are you interested in being an officer next year? Elections will be held after school in Ms. Van Gorda's room on Friday, June 1st. Come prepare with the speech for the office you would like to hold, including president, vice president, secretary, treasurer, or public relations. Please see Ms. Van Gorda if you have any questions. Attention all students who would like to appeal their final exam exemption. This is a reminder that all appeal forms are available in the main office or pickup after school. Students in grades 9, 10, and 11, the deadline to turn in your final exam appeal form is June 1st at 3 o'clock p.m. Do you want to help animals? You can by donating to the Leadership Class Community Outreach Project, Cause for Paws. During your second hour classes, leadership students will be coming around to collect unopened dog or cat food, unopened or gently used pet toys, linens, treats, and cleaning supplies. All donations will be given to the NBS Animal Rescue, and each item you bring in will earn your class one point toward the spirit shield. If you have any questions, please see Mrs. Sonnefeld in C227 or bring your donations directly to her classroom. And now let's turn things over to Fist News reporter Kayla Gerard, who is standing by with one of the pet rally participants. Kaylee? Kayla. Hi, I'm Kayla Gerard with Fitz News, and I'm interviewing a sophomore, Davion Lyons, about the pep rally. So, Davion, who do you think is going to win the pep rally? Spirit Shield. Well, not to play any favoritism, but I always think the sophomores are going to win. Class of 2020, woot woot. Okay, um, do you know what games are going to be at the pep rally? Well, of course, we're going to have Hula Hoop, Musical Chairs, Scavenger Hunt, um, if there's time, Water Balloon Toss and one or two more. Okay. Do you have anything to tell any of the students about winning? Like, any advice? Um, I'd say just keep focus on the games, play fairly, and don't be such a sore loser because it's, you know, just a pep rally, not the Olympics. <laughs> just have fun, don't worry, and everything will turn out okay. Okay, thank you, Davion. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Kayla, and good luck at the pep rally, Davion. Well, that's it for today's show. Have a great afternoon.